afternoon to you. All right, I'm pleased to introduce to you one of our most newest members, Terry Smith. He's a new guy that came out, but he can play golf. Wait till you hear some of his candid answers. The guys are already afraid of him that's played with him a couple of times, so he's putting down some stuff. I want you to listen to this guy's interview, especially the empowering tip that he gives to you. You got to hear this. It's really good. All right. So without further ado, I'm getting out the way. Let's see Terry Smith. Here we go. Good afternoon, golf fans. B-Man. That's right. B-Man Golf TTI sitting out on the patio with Mr. T. Smith. Terry, how are you? Doing good today. All right, man. I know it's a it's a it's a late in the afternoon and everybody's dry, so I'm gonna get you real quick. Uh, how old was Terry when he first started playing golf? Let's well, start. He played. To... Uh, I was stationed overseas in Korea in '67 and '69. Probably played uh, maybe 18 holes back then, and then didn't take the game up to like seven or eight years later. So maybe 30s, something like that. Something like that. Wow! But you're an excellent player. I've seen. Oh man, you're tearing it up out here. I'm just an average player. All right, average. Okay. <laughs> Let's be honest. All right. Now, what motivates you to keep playing this game after all these years? It's fun. And I like the camaraderie with friends, and you meet you meet strangers that become your friends, and it's a social game, but it takes a little bit of skill, but all in all, it's fun. And and over, over time, what has it meant to you to, to, to play golf? What is it? Well, I, I was... Uh, my son and I became uh -huh. friends because uh -huh. he, he became a good player, and, uh -huh. and I was not as good as him, but it was good to play. And it just, uh, I like the fellowship, and I like the family atmosphere. There's always the clubhouse, there's, there's older, there's younger, there's kids. It's a good mixture of people, and whatever goes with that. There you, know? you go. Now, real quickly, uh, before I let you go, if you had to give a beginner golfer, intermediate golfer, a tip, what tip would Terry give? I would tell a beginning golfer or an enemy golfer, never touch a driver or wood. Chip and putt till you can make it 40% of the time and then move on. Don't worry about hitting the ball, worry about scoring the ball. Did you hear what he just said? Did you hear that tip? Now, real quickly, uh, before I let you go, if you had to give a beginner golfer, intermediate golfer, a tip, what tip would Terry give? I would tell a beginning golfer or an enemy golfer, never touch a driver or wood. Chip and putt till you can make it 40% of the time and then move on. Don't worry about hitting the ball, worry about scoring the ball. Wow, that is very interesting. I think the viewer's going to enjoy what you had to say because out of 55 shows, no one has given that good a tip. That is a good tip. It is, yeah, it is I wish man. I'd have had it when I was a <laughs> <laughs> Brother, we appreciate you taking a little bit of time. Let's go inside and get that beer. What do you say? Beer's on me. All right, man. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, T. That was good, man. Yeah. I haven't heard that tip. And there you go. I promised you he was an interesting fellow, and there you go. He delivered. How about that tip he gave? Bet you weren't thinking about that one. Nope. It's very important, and he is hitting the nail on the head with that. So take heed if you're just starting out, you're beginner, intermediate type of player. Terry Smith's tip is probably one of the top tier tips that you will hear as a beginner or an even an intermediate player just starting out. Great conversation. Thank you, Mr. Smith. Look forward to playing with you, my man. You know how I do. Put him like you own him and rock the baby.
Thank you.